In this video, it's going to be super quick. We're going to look at how to calculate percent composition. So percent composition, percent comp, is always going to be by mass. Okay, so you're going to need to know how to calculate your molar masses, or you're going to need to at least be able to look at your periodic table, okay, and look and find the elements to find their average atomic masses. You got this. All right, so the, the actual equation for percent composition is going to be the mass of the element you want divided by the total mass times 100, okay? So the mass of whatever element in that compound that you're talking about divided by total mass times 100. An example would be C2H5 OH, all right? This is ethanol, okay, all right. It's a random compound, and you need to figure out the percent composition, okay? All that means is I need to break it apart by the different elements and figure out by mass what percent of this compound is carbon, what percent of its mass is hydrogen, what percent of its mass is oxygen, okay? So I'm gonna figure it out for carbon, for hydrogen, for oxygen, for each element within the compound, all right? And all you do is, I, I would suggest first thing is get the total molar mass. Okay, so two carbons plus five hydrogens plus one oxygen plus another hydrogen, boop, boop, boop in your calculator, and we get 46.07, okay, grams per mole, Z, right? Because each carbon is 12.01, each hydrogen is 1.01, oxygen is 16, add them all up, you should get 46.07, okay? All right, so now I need to figure out for carbon, for hydrogen, for oxygen of each one of these, okay? So for carbon, each carbon is 12.01, I have two carbons. I'm going to say 12.01 times 2 equals 24.02. This amount divided by my total, 46.07. And then since it's a percent, I'm going to multiply by 100. And I would get that this is 52.14% carbon. This ethanol compound is 52% carbon. For hydrogen, each hydrogen is 1.01 .01 grams per mole times, there's five, six of them. 6.06 .06 divided by the total, which is 46.07 times 100 is 13.15%. Okay, for oxygen, there's only one of them. So 16 times one is 16 divided by 46.07 times 100 is 34.73%. Quick note, okay? So sometimes when you add all of them up, like if you did, oh, ugh, okay, like if you did with this, you would end up getting 100.02, which will freak everyone out, right? Because it can only be out of 100. How can it be out of 100.02%? Okay, don't freak out. It's just because of how we rounded to the hundredths, okay, or whatever. So, yes, this is technically, it's not going to be out of 100.02, okay? Just don't, don't freak out. You're just rounding appropriately with your sig figs and such, okay? Um, all right, so that is percent composition, not bad. 